Hey, how you guys doing? What's up guys, it's Wolf, you're one and only, and today we're going to be doing a little bit of Destiny Child. It's been a while since I've uh, actually uploaded anything about it. Mostly just because I've been focusing on the world bosses and everything. That's pretty much it. So nothing new has been going on, anything like that. Mostly just for you guys' progression of how my count goes or what new events are coming around. So right now, world boss is just ending season is over we defeated level 10 phase 10 so yeah pretty much game over you guys now have until the end of the day to use your points which i have basically done oh apparently i have a little bit of straggler points but yeah mostly everything i've bought i only bought eve because i i wasn't like too too active in the event it requires you to just hop on constantly when it comes to world boss that i've learned like you're gonna need to hop on every last single boss in order to get like a crap ton of this stuff and you're gonna need to do some serious damage just to be able to like completely full fill out this whole thing to be honest i was close to getting um arch fiend dava along with this but it came to the end of the event, so I had to spend it on these two tickets and the rest of these, like, refining orbs. Already used them. Didn't get anything good out of it. Eh, not too bummed, about it. bummed out about it. Progression has been pretty good. But yeah, we got our one Davi. So yeah, we'll wait for her to come back within, like, a summon or something. I'm not, like... I'm not, like... You know, completely going after or anything like that. It's not like I can get her to plus six just by that event. Highest you can get is like plus two and no, no, not plus two, plus one, actually. So instead of going for Davi, I chose to grab an Eve, and I did a summon on stream and I got an, another Eve, which is perfection. I recently just made a uh, Mona level six plus six. So that's going to be great for like a tank. That should be fun. Now I'm going to have to level her up on the weekend. When we get like the whole XP boost thing. But I do want to check and see if they have any news on the next event. Or maybe we'll just have some downtime. Or maybe Paradise will come back. I haven't seen that in a while. I already finished the demon thing. Demon Fiesta. That was completed, so yeah. Other characters I've been working on. Yeah, my Eve is nearly as strong as um, her. Nearly. Actually, what are her points? Okay, so yeah, we just need to raise a little bit more stuff. Actually, her attack is a lot higher. Just take this gear off and just hand it over to her. Way better stats. Well, except for defense. Defense isn't the best. I guess replacing the weapon would be fine. Maybe. I have a lot of random gear now. I think about it. <laughs> but this is pretty much my leveling. Yeah, characters that need to be leveled team. Still cannot find one more leader. I get every other four star in the world, but except for that last leader. Wait, where is she? Oh, I guess she's all the way down here. I put a little bit of stuff into her. Not too much. I, I kind of stopped. For now. I did get the skin for the um, mermaid chick. So, yeah. To be honest... I like the skin a lot more than the original. Where is she? Oh, yeah, I actually started working on this character too. Oh, did not tell you put her as favorite, but all right. This character is also plus uh, three. I guess I did pass her. I 
Oh yeah, there she is. I finally started to work on debuffers. Took me long enough. Because debuffers... The thing is, I always work on defenders and attackers and supports, but I never work really too much on debuffers. Debuff debuffers seem like my weakest area. Actually, I don't even think I work on tanks. It's normally just attackers, healers, and support, and that's pretty much it. But I need to start working on debuffers because they're going to save me a lot. Stuff like Olga, stuff like, um, where is she down here? I mean, she's in my party, so. Yeah, stuff like this character. She's definitely going to help me because of the blind. Blind just basically misses damage, so. Yeah, I could be taking less damage than I need to be taking. Or oh, I could do MOA. Yeah, we could work on MOA. I also could work on you, just for the confusion effect, and keeping them basically from attacking. Alright, there must be an echo in her room, apparently. <laughs> But yeah, not too much has changed, but, you know, we've gotten pretty decently far. Um, I think my highest damage is out of that. Oh, actually, I don't even know my rank. Hey, you're in the way. Oh, they don't keep the records. Oh, God, that was the current boss. Eh. Even though I... I did miss, miss like some levels of a boss phase. Not too bad. Let's see what reward I'm getting. God damn it, you're in the way again. <laughs> I would love to be in first place. That's too much of a hassle. So that's what I'm going to get at the end of the event. Eh, I'll take it. Ain't terrible rewards. Yeah, but these were my only trial missions that were left. The whole damage in one single, like, going <laughs> was not happening. Not for me, at least. In the power team, I think I, I think my max power was, like, 200,000. I couldn't make it to, the, like, the extra 50,000. So, yeah, that was kind of out of the question. But at least I got the Davi. At least we got that. Now I'm looking back. Now I'm looking forward to another um, Ragnar break, to be honest. World Boss was fun, but I kind of missed the good old Ragnar break. I had 17,000 of these friendship coins. I just say it was a hassle getting through all of them. I don't even have any gold just because I used it on making Mona and plus six, sixing her and that was like straight up a million gold. I think at least two million. Well, going on two million. Nah. Nah, it was a million. Because it takes 500,000 in order to evolve and then also takes like 906... 100,000? Now, 960,000. No. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, okay, no, that was right. <laughs> so, yeah, that's pretty much all the progress we've made so far. But let's go check and see if I can find a way to get to their site and see if they talked about anything. Okay, I've lost where this little tracker is gone. So give me a second. All right, we're here. It seems like, oh, we're getting our collab. We're getting another collab. I remember these characters, but I don't know what the hell they're from. Oh, that's what they're from. 
Like, I've, I know I've seen these characters before, but what the hell? I'm going to save this for thumbnail because <laughs> I'm too lazy. But there's no other way for me to make a thumbnail on phone. All right, let's see. So the first one, I think this is the main character too. But yeah. All right, her skill, she gives, well, she does damage, does Verimperium too. She's just basically still HP. Uh, side skill, deals damage to one enemy. Priority supports three additional hits of defense ignore. Gains evasion if it hits critical. Ah, okay. Drive skill. Deals damage up to four enemies. Aims for the lowest HP. Leader skill increases wood damage. Well, no, increases crit rate for wood allies. Meh, pretty decent. All right, next character. Uh, tap skill. Does damage. Um, increases crit for the highest attacker. The second. Well, I was about to say the second skill. The slide skill. Deals damage and increases. Oh, hold on. Let's make sure I'm reading that right. Uh, well, I am reading something right. Those triple sixes. Fucking demon character. Freaking helling Satan over here. <laughs> hey, who deals damage gets plus defense and attack to two allies with the highest attack. That extra, like, defense to the attacker is going to be actually pretty good. Because everything else just increases attack. That's that's pretty much it. That's his go thing. But increasing attack and defense, you know, giving it a little bit of more tankiness, that's going to be perfect. Let's see. Drive. Deals damage to three random enemies. Oh, increases max HP and agility for two, well, no, for three allies. Holy shit. I like this character. This character is going to be a really good support. Uh, leader skill. Increases evasion of 12% for fire allies. Okay, so fire character. And I think the last one. And it's a water unit. So, seems more like a tank from what I see already. But let's see. Uh, the tap skill gains a barrier to where it absorbs up to 600. Eh, not as, not as good as most other tanks for like barriers but you know you still gotta level up so yeah slide skill gains evasion and taunt oh that could actually be really good evasion and taunt instead of like you know defense increase and and taunt you know that could actually be really good because you're also evading and if you put you know blind on the enemies that's also just going to make her even better. I can actually see her working out pretty fine. Seems, seems pretty good. Just with that. Alright, drive. Deals damage to two random enemies. All allies gets a 50% evasion. Oh. So it's not just locked on to like one element. That's, that's pretty good. Increases the defense for... Ally, for water allies. Oh, they're finally having in um, Jupiter's um, female skin. So if you guys have been looking forward to that, that's going to be in there. Too bad it's going to be in the Devil Pass, though. It's not going to be in, like, the actual shop. They have yet to upgrade the freak. Yeah, they have yet to update the whole freaking um, costume shop. That's the thing I'm worried about. All right, so we got events. Let's see what's all in here. So we got scenario dungeons that are coming. Basically those narrative dungeons, I'm guessing. Uh, Paradise is coming. A new demon fiesta is coming. And a chance of wood ticket 
is coming. So I'm guessing a wood event is coming up next afterwards. No, I'm guessing a water event is coming up next afterwards. Maybe it'll be um, that uh, water chick for Bragg to break next. The one everybody was looking for. The one with the whole talismans in where she, <laughs> she always showed her ass as her alternative skin if you if you were able to get it but season eight is starting already well season eight of the devil pass that is i don't know if it's actually just season eight no nah, i think it's just season eight for the devil pass and that's pretty much it like everything's separated in its own season apparently but yeah that's pretty much the update so, with that said, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for coming and stopping by. I had to make sure it was still recording. I didn't want to go through that again. <laughs> but, yeah, it's been good to get some Destiny Child back up. And I'll keep you guys up to date. Until then, peace out.